Greetings, knowledge seekers. It is estimated that approximately 6 million galaxies existed between 500 and 700 million years after the Big Bang, a period when the universe was still in its earliest stages of development. This amazing discovery has shaken previous conceptions about galaxy formation, which until now was believed to follow a slower and more gradual process. Scientists expected to find small galaxies in the process of formation in the early cosmos, mere groups of stars and dust that would slowly evolve into the complex structures we know today. However, new measurements revealed by the James Webb Space Telescope have shown something completely different. Mature galaxies, surprisingly similar to ours, already existed in that early period, directly challenging established theories about the early evolution of the universe. James Webb has been fundamental to this discovery thanks to its unique ability to observe the universe in infrared wavelengths. This infrared light, which is invisible to the human eye, allows the telescope to capture the faint radiation emitted by the oldest stars and galaxies, offering a literal window into the past up to about 13.5 billion years ago. The James Webb's ability to observe so deeply in time has revealed an impressive panorama. Large and well-formed galaxies existed in an era when the universe was thought to host mainly small, forming galaxies. This finding not only questions but challenges 99% of existing cosmological models, which described these early galaxies as simple clouds of stars and dust that would condense and form larger structures over billions of years. When examining the data obtained by the telescope, scientists were perplexed to find such large and mature galaxies in the early cosmos. The surprise was such that some team members even began to doubt their initial interpretation of the data as the presence of these enormous structures appeared with disconcerting rapidity in the images, suggesting that galactic evolution might have been much more accelerated than anticipated. To analyze these surprising objects, the research team used a technique called spectroscopy, which involves breaking down the light emitted by galaxies into its different components. This method not only allows the identification of the elements that make up these galaxies, but also facilitates the measurement of their actual distances and precise location in space. By studying the light emitted by these galaxies, scientists have been able to obtain a more complete and detailed view of these gigantic structures, providing crucial information about their nature, origin, and evolution. However, despite these exciting advances, scientists remain cautious and open to different interpretations. Although the evidence collected so far strongly points to us observing mature galaxies, there is a possibility that some of these objects are actually masked supermassive black holes, which would further challenge our understanding of the early universe. These black holes could be surrounded by clouds of gas and dust so dense that they emit an amount of light comparable to that of an entire galaxy, making it difficult to differentiate them without more detailed analysis. The discovery of these possible mature galaxies at such an early stage of the universe opens new questions about the nature of the cosmos and compels us to reconsider many of the foundations of modern cosmology. Could it be that the early universe was much more dynamic and active than we imagine? Or are we witnessing even more extraordinary phenomena that are beyond our current capacity for understanding? As scientists continue to examine and debate these questions, the James Webb Telescope continues to offer data and observations that bring us a little closer to unraveling the mysteries of the universe. This discovery is just the beginning of what could be a new era in astronomy, where each new finding challenges our beliefs and forces us to expand our horizons. By analyzing the data obtained by the James Webb Space Telescope, astronomers managed to identify some of the oldest and most distant galaxies ever detected, dating back to less than 400 million years after the Big Bang, when the universe was just beginning its development. These discoveries are not only significant for their antiquity, but have also been rigorously verified through exhaustive spectroscopic observations. This technique has allowed scientists to study in detail the physical characteristics of these galaxies, precisely determine their distances, and evaluate how they have evolved over time. One of the most notable recent findings focuses on four galaxies that present a redshift greater than 10, which was confirmed through spectroscopy. A redshift of 13.2, for example, corresponds to a temporal distance of approximately 13.5 billion years, which means we are observing these galaxies as they were in a period very close to the origin of the universe. 
To achieve these discoveries, scientists used the near-infrared camera and spectrograph of James Webb, tools that have been essential in unraveling the mysteries of the early universe. The JADES program, James Webb Space Telescope Advanced Deep Extra Galactic Survey, is one of the most ambitious initiatives in modern astronomy, supported by a team of more than 80 astronomers and scientists from 10 countries. This program is dedicated to studying the most distant galaxies, exploring the cosmos in search of clues about how the first galactic structures formed and evolved. For more than 10 days, the JADES program, an integral part of GES, observed a small area of the sky near the Hubble Ultra Deep Field, a region of space that has been explored for more than 20 years with virtually all the world's major telescopes. In this region, astronomers discovered almost 100,000 distant galaxies, each located thousands of millions of light years away. The JADES team devoted three days to studying these galaxies in nine infrared wavelength bands, gathering valuable information about the gas and stars that compose them. By analyzing the infrared light, scientists were able to identify the specific characteristics of these galaxies and obtain precise measurements of the redshift. This analysis allowed them to determine the intrinsic luminosity of the galaxies and estimate the number of stars they contain, which is crucial for understanding how they were built over time. The discovery of these ancient and distant galaxies offers us a unique opportunity to better understand the early stages of galactic formation and how these initial processes have influenced cosmic evolution. These findings not only enrich our knowledge about the origin of the universe, but also force us to reconsider our theories about the evolution of galaxies and the structure of the cosmos as a whole. The James Webb Telescope has proven to be an extraordinary tool for revealing the deepest secrets of the universe. Thanks to its ability to observe in the infrared spectrum, the telescope has opened a unique window to the cosmos, allowing astronomers to study galaxies, planets, and stars in unprecedented detail. James Webb is expected to continue operating for at least 20 more years and has already taken significant steps in scientific research since its launch. Among the most surprising discoveries of the telescope are not only exoplanets and newly formed stars, but also the oldest known black hole, which has revealed detailed information about its formation and evolution in the early universe. These black holes detected in the young cosmos pose a great mystery for astronomers, as they seem to have grown rapidly in a period when such structures were thought to be just beginning to form. Although the possibility has been raised that some of these black holes are primordial, that is, formed shortly after or even before the Big Bang, it is still not fully understood how they managed to emerge so early in the history of the cosmos. These cosmic objects emit weak radiation that has traveled through the universe since its beginnings, generating growing interest in the astronomical community. The search for an explanation of how black holes emerged so quickly in the early times of the cosmos remains an enigma that scientists continue to investigate with determination. The possibility that these primordial black holes exist adds a new dimension to our understanding of the early universe and raises fundamental questions about the nature of the cosmos. To this day, the abundance of black holes in the universe remains an enigma that challenges the scientific community. Two main explanations have been proposed to try to solve this mystery. The first theory suggests that current black holes could be the remnants of massive stars that formed much faster than the stars we see today. These giant stars, composed mainly of hydrogen and helium, would have emerged shortly after the Big Bang and, after exhausting their fuel, would have exploded as supernovas, leaving black holes behind. The second theory posits that these black holes could have originated from dense gas clouds that suddenly collapsed, giving rise to these singularities in space-time. The existence of a population of primordial stars, composed almost exclusively of hydrogen and helium, and which would have existed in the earliest moments of the universe, is one of the topics of greatest interest. These stars, which emerged shortly after the Big Bang, could have had such large masses that when they exploded, they generated black holes that have survived to this day. This formation process is one of the proposed mechanisms to explain the abundance of black holes in the current universe. To unravel the origin of these mysterious black holes, Scientists are collaborating with the team that developed a specialized instrument to detect clearer signals of light from distant galaxies. These light emissions could contain valuable information about the processes that led to the formation of black holes in the nuclei of these galaxies. 
An impressive example of this collaboration is the recent observation of a group of seven galaxies interacting with each other, which has given rise to the most distant protocluster of galaxies discovered so far. According to simulations, this galactic system could become one of the largest and oldest clusters in the universe, with a mass estimated to be almost 100 times greater than that of our own galaxy, the Milky Way. The James Webb Space Telescope has been fundamental in revealing these findings, although it still does not have the necessary sensitivity to precisely measure the distances between these distant galaxies, comparable to trying to observe cities from an airplane without being able to determine exactly the distance that separates them. Technological advances expected in the next decade promise to make these discoveries much more precise. NASA's Space Telescope Science Institute is already planning the launch of a new instrument in early 2027 that will be capable of identifying galaxy clusters in the early universe, such as those found in recent studies. This new instrument will have a mapping capacity up to 100 times superior to that of James Webb, which will mark a milestone in modern astronomy. In the field of exoplanet research, the James Webb Telescope has been a crucial tool contributing significantly to the discovery and study of numerous planets outside our solar system. One of the notable exoplanets is HIP 65426b, a gaseous giant that orbits at a considerable distance from its host star, located 100 times farther than Pluto is from our Sun. These types of discoveries not only expand our knowledge about exoplanets, but also bring us closer to understanding the diversity of planetary systems that exist in our galaxy. Additionally, the James Webb Telescope has captured amazing images, such as that of the M74 galaxy, showing fascinating spatial structures and surprising details of stars and stellar clusters. These observations have allowed astronomers to study distant objects with unprecedented clarity and precision, revealing discoveries that were previously virtually impossible to perceive. These advances are not only changing our understanding of the cosmos, but are also challenging established theories and opening new avenues of research. The ability of James Webb to observe the universe in infrared wavelengths has been fundamental to these achievements, allowing scientists to look deeper into the cosmic past and discover secrets that until recently seemed unreachable.